We want to get back to what's going on in Seattle, a pretty large protest uh, that we've been following for the last couple of hours. And we have a couple of people of our reporters down there. Vanessa Mashanya, let's get to you. Uh, is it breaking up? Are people still peacefully protesting? What's happening? Hey, Joyce, we're at uh, 12th and Pine, really right in front of the police station on Capitol Hill. There's these metal barricades right in front of this crowd where the marchers stopped, and they're remaining peaceful. Uh, most protesters right now are kneeling, some with their hands up, uh, continuing the message that they have ever since they took off um, in Westlake. This is the same group that has been maintaining the peace all day. They've kept nonviolence as their main point here, and they didn't want to sh have anything like like yesterday overshadow the message and the purpose of why they are in the streets today. So again, this is the group that started around 3.30 this afternoon, uh, going from Westlake to, to second to fourth, back to Westlake, and then around five o'clock, uh, that was when they started making their way up to Capitol Hill. Curfew did hit at five o'clock and the organizers were honest. They were saying, hey, you know, you can go home. Uh, if you go home, go on and, and organize and try to push the message forward. But if you do choose to uh, come with us past the curfew at five, just promise to, to keep it peaceful. And even earlier in the day, we did see a couple arrests in this group. We did see one or two or three um, antagonizers, but those were stopped by the leaders of this march. Um, anyone who was really trying to antagonize police when they were making their way around downtown, they're like, hey, this is not what this is all about. And they've they've kept it peaceful. Um, the marchers are, are maintained a nonviolent approach here. I've even seen folks with, with garbage bags picking up trash along the way as they are marching around Capitol Hill, uh, which we've been going around for the past uh, hour and a half.